Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to try something a little bit different. I wanted to do a story time video and I've seen a lot of these videos on YouTube and I'm not gonna lie, I get sucked into them all the time because I just find them to be super interesting. But before I start my story, um, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Feel free to subscribe so that you can be notified when I post new videos and let's get started so this story okay let's see this took place about two years ago i was a sophomore in college at the time and one of my friends is a guy friend we had decided that we were going to hang out that day and we were going to do something casual so we ended up deciding to meet up at our local park and while we were there we did just normal stuff talk I think we went and got coffee and we just chilled listened to music and this was like the afternoon so it was getting kind of dark out and I believe he told me that he had to go pick up his brother from like a friend's house or something his younger brother so I was like okay so it was probably about seven no, it was probably about 8.30ish when this happened. Now, just a little bit of background on our park, our local park. It is very sketchy at nighttime, but I was, I never go to the park at nighttime. I mean, I usually am not at the park anyway. So, but there are a lot of like homeless people and just weird people that roam our local park. So, I mean, with that in mind, that's why this story is just kind of, mm. I ended up getting out of his like SUV type of car and walking over to my car, which was like a couple parking spaces down. Now, I wasn't paying any attention to my surroundings. I was just like, okay, get in my car, time to go home. So, I opened my car, I got in, and I don't know what I was doing. I think I turned on my car and I was probably like, fidgeting in my purse looking for who knows what I had no idea but I was sitting in the parking lot for a minute and you know I'm looking through my bag or whatever and I hear on my window and I'm like I look up and I'm like who in the world is knocking on my window when I look up it's this woman and she's standing at my window looking in and she caught me off guard because she looked kind of like disheveled I guess like she had on clothes that looked like she had them on for a couple days and they were wrinkly and just like dirty looking almost and her hair was like all over the place and she just looked like she might have been on drugs or something but and she but the thing was she was kind of awkward like she had like an awkward way about herself and I was really contemplating like should I open like roll my window down or should I just ignore her because she looks kind of creepy or she looks kind of scary and I don't I don't know what she's gonna do but I've just decided in my head like well what if she needs help or something and I just ignore her like that would be so mean so I like roll my window down a crack so I can hear what she's saying thinking that she's gonna ask me for something like money or you know I don't know what she would ask me for but I like that was where my mind went I rolled down the window and I'm like you know like how can I help you and she's like um and she had a really soft voice and she seemed like she was kind of scared to ask but she's like um my friend wanted me to ask you if you wanted to come join us and I just was like, at that moment, I was like, say what? Um, my friend wanted me to ask you if you wanted to join us. I was just like, no, no, I don't want to join y'all. Like, no, no, mm, roll it back up. I don't know who you are and I don't know who your friend is, but I don't want to come join y'all for anything. She walks away and gets into the passenger side of this car, which, like I said before, I hadn't even been paying attention to my surroundings. So I didn't know, like, who she was talking about, where she came from, 
So I look at the car and it's kind of like this oldish SUV, like kind of like a Tahoe looking type of car or truck or SUV, whatever you want to call it. And I look in the front to see like who she was talking about and all I can see is like a figure, like a, a silhouette of somebody. And um, it's, I could tell it was a guy, but I didn't, I couldn't see his features. I didn't know who he was. And she looked sketchy from the beginning. So I was like, what in the world? Is he like a pimp or something? Is he like, you know, going out and to the local parks to see if he can recruit some young girls to get into his car. The thing that creeped me out was she was an older woman. Like you could tell she was probably in her late 20s, early 30s. I was at the time 19. So I was like, that that just seemed like a red flag. Like why would you ask 19 year old looking girls, teenage looking girls to get in a car with you. I mean, I guess 18 is legal, but still like, mm, something don't sound right about that. Just from the overall thing, I was like, no, like I don't know what's going on with this situation, but I think it's time for me to go. So as soon as she got back in the car and I actually saw like movement in the back too, I was like, maybe they just assume because I got out of a SUV kind of late and got into my car that I must be trying to like get into somebody else's car or something. I don't know what they thought, but I put my little car in reverse and I reversed out of that parking lot and I zoomed on out and I was like making sure that they weren't following me because he just, it was just creepy. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I overreacted, but I don't think so. When someone who looks like that knocks on your window and asks if you want to come join them, that's just weird. Like, I don't know not the craziest story in the world but just one of the crazy things that happened to me and I just thought it was kind of funny so have no idea whatever became of those people I've never seen that car again never seen her again um, hopefully she's okay hopefully there was nothing too crazy going on there but it did look a little suspicious in my personal opinion but yeah this is the end of my video i hope you enjoyed listening to my weird story and uh if you did enjoy make sure to give this video a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed already make sure to do that and i will talk to you guys in my next video bye